All right, coming up next, it's a middleweight title fight between Ronaldo Souza and Luke Rockhold. Our tale of the tape for this middleweight championship fight. The American is 33. The Brazilian is 38. Rockhold is two inches taller. He will have a five-inch reach advantage. Here's Bruce Buffer. All right, here we go. The wait is over. The UFC's 185-pound title is up for grabs right here, right now. Nice defense on the single leg takedown. You can tell he's worked on that. Rockhold gets back up. Switching stances here. Caught him with a punch. Blocks the shot. Didn't quite connect. So his opponent lands that kick to the body, Joe, and he has shown an increased susceptibility to that strike here tonight. Very nice leg kick there by Souza. Left kick to the body. Clean punch. Lands a big right hand. Nailed him with the right hand. That one hurt. Good punch. Oh, tagged him. Just over three minutes to go, round one. Nice leg kick. All of those are blocked. Level change there. Jacare gets the takedown. Nice. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Oh, elbow to the head. Big oh, elbow beautiful there, elbow. He's in half guard. What a brilliant pass. Right into mount. Excellent job. Nice shot to the head. Rockhold gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that hit off the center line. Excellent movement here on the ground. Half guard. Big punch from the top. Now he gets the full mount again. He's mounted. He's got to control his posture. Oh, he got cracked. Rockhold getting absolutely worked here from the top. Let's see if there's an uptick in his urgency here as he tries to get back up. Now he's back into full guard. Oh, nice elbow from the bottom. Hard to win a fight fighting off of your back, but he's effective here. Big body punch. Changes his stance. You'll see a lot of this from this fighter. Rockhold gets hit with a kick. Round two straight ahead. Are you ready? Ready? Fight. Round two on the way. Effective punch there by Rockhold. He switched again to southpaw. Eats a, a nice right hand. Oh. This could be it. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. Oh, very nice. How about that shin? Oh, he lands another strike to the body here. He's really starting to connect Joe on a lot of these strikes to the midsection. Absolutely. Big power shot there. And speed, man. Now he goes for the single leg. Well, Joe, he seems to have his opponent's timing down. He has landed some good shots, but nothing really in terms of multi-shot combinations, and perhaps that's why his opponent's still standing. So perhaps at this point, he could change up the power with which he throws some of these strikes, maybe alter the tempo a little bit, and try to make it so it's not just one and done when it comes to his striking attack. And he goes to the knee to the body. 
Oh, Rockhold's got the double underhooks here on the clinch now, Joe. Let's see what he can do with it. Well, a really good second round for him thus far after a somewhat lackluster first round. He has found the rhythm and found his striking range. Scary proposition for the opponent now here in round two. Oh, and he goes switch kick to the body, Joe. Nice job there by Rockhold. Stuffs that takedown attempt. You'll need a better shot than that to get him down. The Brazilians in the crowd start their chant. Foot stop there by Rockhold. Tying up in the clinch here. And separate. There's a single attempt. Shows against the single leg takedown. Oh, he found the target there. That'll work. Wow, outstanding. He lands a big shot from the bottom. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. Look at the torso on the right side. Major bruising, and it's only getting worse. Outstanding pressure from top position here by Rockhold. He oh, lands a elbow. huge elbow to the head. Huge elbow there, Joe. Nice reversal here into half guard. Oh, effective strike there by Jacare Sosa there. Nice combination from the half guard here. Well, pretty good work off of the bottom here by Rockhold. From the mound here, he's got to control his opponent's posture. All right, that's the end of round number two. Here we go, third round of this championship fight. At the end of that round, his opponent was clearly hurt. He's gonna look to start this round off fast and try to pick up where he left off. Now he's inside control. And dizzy as he looks to improve position here. Back to side control. Excellent punch. That bruise on his torso is getting bad. Trying to take the back here. Right back in full guard. It looks to me like he's trying to turn towards either side. Rockhold gets the takedown. Now let's see if he chooses to pass here, Joe. We march on three minutes to go. Working on a choke here, potentially. He's looking for a guillotine choke. He's in full guard here. What he needs to do to get the guillotine is first, he's got to throw his arm over the back of his opponent's head. Then he's got to slide his forearm. Oh, and that will it. do it! He got the choke for the tap. Well, yeah, so the work in the gym pays off here tonight as he gets the win by submission. Gorgeous setup on the choke, and I think even better execution down the stretch. Clearly, it was sunk in deep. His opponent had no choice but to tap or take a nap. In this case, he chose to tap out. And here's the end of the fight.